have- yeah, the power of mono white painter is in the starting hands for sure. All right, looks like uh, Mulligan to five for Rockford, weighing two cards to put on the bottom. They have been selected, and we are ready to go. Let's see. It. Let's do it. Basic planes, grindstone, and Eddie is back at it. Everybody. Same thing as Ryan. Same Eddie. Ready. Nothing has changed. Okay. All right, cracking a polluted delta has Rockford now. <laughs> yeah, Rockford has a nice play map. All right, here's a ponder for Rockford. Rockford having a good time with the new play mat so far, I would say. I don't know. <laughs> Roberts is very strongly rooting for Eddie here. Wow. <laughs> Rockford made it to the finals of a webcam legacy league we have in the 90s MTG community Discord server. So that was a big accomplishment. Mother of Runes revealed on top. Now you drop. That is pretty good. I will uh, wasteland you. Yep. And play my mom. <laughs> Waste and play a mom. Oh. Uh, are You're allowed to force a little bit. Uh, I don't want to do that. I want to play a uh, wasteland. Okay. Wasteland, no target, but could be good protection against Urza's Saga. Ancient Den, play a second Mother of Runes and then attack. Wow. Aggro. Uh, Should I change the overlay to mono white aggro? <laughs> so this wasteland has to uh, respect Urza's saga to some extent. <laughs> yeah, this painter list is wild. Heflo must be new around here and must not be aware of any of the intern shenanigans. Caracas swing pass. Which one was that? Last three? Huh? Which land was that? Oh, uh, last three first. Combat? Yeah. This is. Yeah. Dragon's Rays Channeler is in there. No delirium yet. Uh, how many types? Uh, uh, it's three. Uh, it's just three. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to Nothing to worry about. Oh, that's Force pitching Brazen Bower on the Vial. Trop thrown in the trash. Now Delirium is online. Okay, so the Vial is countered, but it's still on the battlefield for some reason. Okay. Oh, this is yes. Uh, okay. we'll take my turn. Oh. Attacking for three. Yeah. I guess Ray will start swinging away because it has to. Respond. <laughs> Swords on this DRC in response to Brainstorm, and it's dazed. Did Eddie come to stay or just visiting? Eddie, Eddie was just visiting. Another Dragon's Race Channeler passed the turn, so six power on the board is pretty good. Uh, 
Are they going to tap one? Yep. Uh, I mean, no, I guess you're going to tap one. All right, the DRC should be in exile, but it's off the battlefield. Portable hole. That could be a way to remove this DRC. Seek the beast in response. Yep, the results. Only target. Uh, I'll get him for one. So there's a Bowmaster and a Wasteland in Exile that Rockford could cast this turn or play this turn. So, I was thinking cost three. Um, so many plus one. Okay, nice play here by Eddie giving the other Mother of Runes pro black. And that prevents it from dying to Bowmaster here. It might have been better. Let's think about this. If Rockford plays Wasteland. Plays Bowmaster, and then um, with a trigger on the stack, Bolt. That probably removes both Mother of Runes. Oh, wait, no. I would only, uh, yeah, I would only still remove one. Hmm. Okay, never mind. All right, Esper Sentinel comes in. <laughs> Questing Druid is on an adventure, not on the battlefield. That's good. Um, you Looks like Eddie holding Crucible of Worlds in hand. <laughs> questing Druid is in there. Dragon's Rage Channeler. Trigger the Questing Druid. Yes, you would be. There's a two card combo. Exactly. Honestly. Fuck. How many of the 13 of them? I'll waste on the. Um. Okay, you got it. Yes. Take my turn. Got a chemist? Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, I mean, that's what you want to do. Heather Sworn comes in for Eddie. Is MTG bot not working? This is not a May trigger, by the way. Yeah. Yeah. You got how many in hand? Ponder. It's just one. You don't want it. Okay. Ponder's trigger, trigger. Yep. one, Okay, so we'd rather not give Eddie the draw rather than get a ping here off Bowmaster. I think I. Mm, would I let Eddie just draw the card? Probably. Mm, it's hard to say. Eddie's deck does have a combo. There's a saga. Okay. Uh, Play Crucible yeah, Worlds. It's pretty good response to this. Okay, Crucible Worlds will resolve. Eddie can start playing lands from the graveyard next turn. As of right now, there's a Caracas and Ancient Dead in there. I don't know if there's anything else. Yeah, yeah maybe not with Mother Runes on the battlefield, but could ping Eddie, is what I was thinking. I will play this wasteland from here, here and waste red mana. Which one? Uh, red mana. Okay, wasteland was in the yard and going after Rockford's red mana. It looks like there's a response to that. Seek the Beast. No, I think Urza Saga was played last turn. This is on an adventure. I don't know if I'm going to just remember. Uh, these are until next turn. Okay, so Dragon's Race Channeler and Brainstorm are available until next turn. Trigger on the Esper Sentinel pays the tax. Oh, no, I, I think it matters. You should yeah. keep the man out. Yeah. Yeah. 
All right, MTG Bot has dropped the uh, text requesting Druid. Until your next end step, you may play those cards. So if you cast Seek the Beast on your opponent's turn, you can play them until your end step. Yep. Yeah, Great. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Uh, magic together. <laughs> oh, oh, magic together. All right. So a four-four questing druid, and we're attacking with everything. Eddie will make a construct. It'll be big. I believe a six-six. <laughs> this thing is pretty big. How big though? One, two, three, four, five, six. The ring bearer? Six, yes. So one, one. one. The one, one cannot be blocked with yeah. higher power. Four, 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 six, six. Drink, so block. I will block. Yeah. Your go masters with this. Your work army with this. Uh, and I will. Those are my blocks. Okay, so it looks like a triple trade happening here. DRC will get through. And then I will brainstorm trigger trigger. That's fine. Oh. Red. Leave it on top. Mm -hmm. yeah. Brainstorm, leave it on top. <laughs> and then so before move to damage, damage yeah. I'm going to give this protection from green. Okay, so giving... The construct protection from green in the end will save it. So three creatures die for Rockford. Two creatures die, or one creature dies for. Oh, the Edison one Canis is a two-two. I I miscounted before. All right. So Mother Runes protects the construct. The uh, Edison one Canis lives. Uh, <laughs> we don't have to worry about that anymore. Uh, She's dead for real. Well, you could have uh, intentionally let me draw it and paint the mom. I didn't do that, so... Um, uh, so I got passed. Okay, Eddie pointing out plays that could have happened. There's a saga about to tick up to three. Let's see how this goes. Seems good. Construct? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> search. Uh, yeah. All right, Urza Saga will search. Yeah, I'm just trying to count the types. Okay. One, two. Three, uh, you're in color. You have five. No, oh, yeah. This is going to be lame. Um, helping you with the moon. I'm going to do the cool one. Thank you. Who will win the match prediction poll in the chat? I'm going to do the cool one. Don't you even dare style on me. Okay, looks like Eddie's going to do a cool line, he says. Let's see what happens here. <laughs> oh, no. Hope of Gerper. Mm -hmm. It has fun. All right, yeah. I'm going to play Caracas for my graveyard. You may also notice that this is a legendary yeah. creature. I, I did notice that. Very good. <laughs> All right, Caracas, Hope of Gerper, killer combo. Killer combo. Oh, no, I'll attack you with my 2-2 two -two and my 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7. Big attacks coming in. Uncool lines just get solved later to be like extremely lame. <laughs> but that loses to Stifle. So Hopagurper, Caracas combo, double 7 7 constructs. Crucible of Worlds on the battlefield can play Urza Saga next turn. It's not looking good. And Mother Runes on the battlefield. It's not looking good for Rockford right now. Two cards in Eddie's hand. Two, three, the original. Blocks. Yeah. Block. Yeah. Um, Damage. I will return this to my hand. Yeah. And her hope of her upper bounced after blocks. Eddie will remain at four life. Uh, 
I will pass. I have eight cards. Uh, you. Uh, one to me. Uh, Certainly. With nine. All right, a Bowmaster pings Eddie. Those could block. Rockford is at seven. Ooh, okay. He's going to stop the combo here. Force pitching D, Surveil. Yeah, Mother of Runes gives the construct protection and attacks for lethal. Eddie takes game one. What's up, Nucalyptus? How's life in 2023? It's almost over. 2023 is almost over. And some people are watching this later, and it's probably 2024 already for them. All right, two cards on the bottom for Rockford. Tropical Island, Ponder. If you're watching this in the year 2024, wow. Yeah, Harry's saying Happy New Year. Not yet, Harry. Not yet. Hope of Gerper. Yeah, we have some Eddie the Intern fans in the chat. People happy to see Eddie. I'm happy to see Eddie. <laughs> All right, there's Hope of Garper again. It looks like it's in there. Killed me last turn. Yeah, it's the only reason. Oh, that's. Uh, I'll have the only player in my deck. You better watch out. Uh, start playing Poison Dark. Yeah. 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 The song creation uh, so, so, like, I believe I will. Yes. Okay. All right, here's Grindstone. I will pass Seek the beast. Let's see what we find. Brazen Bower and a volcanic island. So most likely the Volk will be played. Nothing really exciting to bounce right now, but could potentially do that just to put Brazen Bower out on an adventure. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, different time zone means different lifestyle, right? Do something about it. Right now. Okay. Uh, um, yeah. Questing Druid gets in there. Prison Bar will be exiled forever. Double Wasteland for ready, but can start pumping out constructs now. Maybe that'll be higher priority. How does the New York City time zone affect the, my lifestyle? Um, I live just the U.S. Eastern lifestyle. I mean, you know. Whatever. Oh, what if I have like a dismember or something? Oh, that's true. Yeah. Seems like something I would have. Good one. I'm not blocking. I was not trusting Just one damage. Uh, yes, oh, what time zone is everybody in that's watching? Where is everybody? YouTube commenters, where are you? My beautiful, my beautiful associate here. We'll make it up. All right, making a construct. Currently a 3 3. Urza Saga ticks up. Making another construct and now searching the library. What will we find this time? Mox Opal. 
Sure. That feels correct. I don't know. Seems like a solid bet. If you had a wasteland, I was just like ultra dead. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> the one that I shipped back to go down to five was two wastelands, three lands, and like a daze. <laughs> like, it's right. probably good against this. <laughs> yeah, I mean, not that big. You, a you counter my open hero for then you waste my thing. I have no game plan. I have like a grindstone in play. Yeah, right. <laughs> I would like to play Magic. Uh, sure. All right, so some really big constructs on Eddie's side of the board. Rockford uh, needs a meltdown, I would say, or at least a dress down. Tap one mana? Yeah. Can I say Retrofitter cool. Foundry? Oh, yeah, that, that is very fun. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> grab me a beer from the garage fridge, please. That is that is unheard of in, in my time zone. I know. Inevitable betrayal. That was turn two. I Yeah, that's on Retrofitter Foundry. Pretty good. Retrofitter Foundry is pretty powerful. Attacking with a construct in hope of Gurupur. Looks like Rockford is fetching now. Okay, Nucalyptus doesn't have any idea what's going on with time zones. Seems completely lost about the situation. Hope of Gerper down. Could Eddie have sacked it there to counter the ability? Or does it have to deal damage? I forgot. Let's look it up. Oh, dealt damage. Okay, never mind. We did not collect lists at this event, but I can try to get a, a list from Eddie. At some point. Eventually. Maybe. Maybe not. We'll see. Probably not. Let's be honest. <laughs> um, if enough people in the in 90s MTG Discord ping Eddie demanding his list, maybe we'll get somewhere. But I, I really have no power. <laughs> Same goes for anybody else. Force pitching Lorian revealed. Triggered the questing druid. Ingenious Smith is countered. Uh, oh, I think Rad this time. Merc Tide Regent getting in for an attack. Eddie's constructs are 4 4s. Questing druid is a 5 5. Here's a DRC. Now it's a 6-6. Six, six. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Ingenious Smith again. This one resolves. Crucible of Worlds. Okay. Yeah, All right, Ingenious Smith will trigger after Ed is sworn canonist. Merktide region still a problem for Reddy, needs to remove it. Can you go to 14? These are five fives now? One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Yeah, the constructs are 5-5. Five, five. Those are two constructs, the Pokemon card and the construct token. Official. Are both 5-5s. Five, five. Uh, search your library. Uh, and he goes down to 7. Um... 
podcast, oh, Oswald, well, a little better. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> yep. There it is. We haven't seen it yet in this match. Oswald Fiddlebender, one of the engines of this deck. Birthing pod for artifacts that Eddie has uh, been using in this mono white painter deck to great success, I would say. Tutors up hate pieces, tutors up the combo. I was thinking about doing something here. Um, Ooh, meltdown. Reprieve. Uh, uh, Oof. And you oh, unmute okay. myself, so you ping me. Yeah. And then you attack me. And, and then I attack you for six. Uh, yeah. All right. Eddie gives instructions on how to win the game. Ping from the Bowmaster off the draw from Re Reprieve, and then attack with Merktide. Going to game three. Uh, Eddie will be on the play. Rockford does not like the sound of Eddie snap keeping the seven. But here we go. Plains, Mother of Runes. Oh, yeah. D's on Painter Servant. Pretty good. Combo piece. I think that's the first time we've seen Painter in this match. Painter countered. Mother Runes attacks. Nucalyptus wants Rockford's play mat. Start putting offers in the chat. Maybe Rockford would be willing to part away part with this playmat for the right price. <laughs> we'll start the auction at um five bucks. Go ahead and make your bids. Never have to see those again. Okay, Roberts also has that play mat and is willing to trade it for four FPB German underground seas specifically. So there's one offer there. All right, naming black with painter servant. Mother runes will stay back this time to protect. Dragon's Rage Channeler, no delirium yet, three types. Yeah, I'll attack you with that one. I will pass the turn. Surveil could turn on Delirium at any point. And then Dragon's Rage Channeler will be attacking, and the race will favor Rockford as things stand right now. The grindstone combo with Painter is scary. Dragon's Rage Channeler stays back. I'll play an ancient turn. Sure. I will attack you with my 1 3. All right, attacking with Painter now. Turn on Delirium and block as a possibility. All right, no blocks. I'll cast Portable Hole. Portable Hole. Could be a way to remove Dragon's Rage Channeler. Looks like Rockford is holding Meltdown. Just spotted that. Brainstorm Surveil. All right, Dragon's Way Chandler comes in, Misha's Bobble comes in, Cervelle. Still no delirium, but Musher's Bobble can make it so. Wasteland, not that great right now. 
portable hull, removed a Dragon's Rays channeler, so that's tucked under there. If Meltdown blows it up, GRC will come back. Mother of Runes can't stop Meltdown. Wasting Caracas. I don't know. I mean, I didn't, I didn't do two. I, if I, if I mean, I don't know what's in uh, Rockford's hand other than Meltdown, but I like respecting Urza Saga with Wastelands generally, but Grindstone combo... Uh, I was just going to say, Grindstone combo is a threat, so maybe trying to trim uh, a mana from Eddy here. Days on the Grindstone. A Mox Opal could end the game here. If this Grindstone resolves and Painter's Servant lives, which Mother Runes will likely make sure it will, Thinking about the surveil. Look like an ingenious smith, maybe on top of Eddie's library. I think Rockford has to fire off a meltdown here, even if it doesn't kill Painter. But it's probably All right, tutoring, finding an underground sea. There's the meltdown. X is one. That'll set back the combo quite a bit. Grindstone, Ancient Den, and Portable Hole are gone. DRC comes back. And with Delirium online, this is looking good for Rockford at the moment. Soul Guide Lantern. That will slow things down. Could remove the graveyard, shut up Delirium. Attack with Painter. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, I like exiling graveyard before a merc tide can be cast. Graveyard is gone. I can't tell for sure, but maybe Eddie has one card in hand. They replaced the, um, the Delvers Less with the other two drivers. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to assume the name red there, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, it looks like one card. Portable Hole had exiled a DRC, but now it's back. Historically, they have frauds, but they must. I mean, it's one of those games that you have to play with. Brainstorm Double Surveil. Ponder in the yard. Common line, let's say you're an ET. Good, right? I think you just have to make all of like Dark Ritual, Dark yeah, Ritual, Daily Summer, and you cast a spell. Potentially pre combat, this brainstorm could have turned on Delirium. But it's hard to say. I can just generate a more additional storm on the RC. What that means is that all I really. Rockford might not be looking for Delirium, might be looking for something else. All right, left the card on top, so not concerned about Delirium right now. No, so you see the mirror again. You have a lot of cards. You draw your last card. You bargain again. Cast it for free. Do it this way. Just cast all four copies. Do it before you get it. What this means is that with two dark cards, you'll run completely. Ooh, Collector Roof is a nasty one. Shuts off Ancient Den for now. Three types in the yard sorcery, instant land, delirium, and reach. Attack for two. 
Attacking a blocking creature. And those aren't really cards you run either because they actually. Uh, yeah. Even if you're on a bond. Cool. So I'll take nothing in this one. I know this deck has gone into following the plow occasionally because plow is so synergistic with the the pile. Like, yeah, yeah. I got four plow. Yeah. Uh, but All right. Channel Daigonjo to remove the not blocked DRC. Collector Roof still a problem here. Retrofitter Foundry, I think we don't care about with Collector Roof on the table. Flashing on a Bowmaster, right? I think I've seen that there's like a one or two. Right. And you, or I'd rather, Nexus be three or five, but you don't really care about packing it. Go ahead. Successful attack for three with Dragon's Rage Channeler. In response to flash yeah, yeah. master. Th that wouldn't come up. I'm that. super dead. Yeah. yeah. Well, Bowmaster's in. <laughs> Looks like um, a Merc Tide is in hand for Rockford. Blazoners a Saga. Not much else going on. There are a couple of that deck creates a lot of things to think about. Like, oh, yeah, I have man land with two of Rig with card as well. And it got bounced with Caracas. And it's still technically a legendary creature at that point. Okay, it pays for Esper Sentinel. It's one of those situations, too, where I think I just let him draw a pink to swing. Yeah, I can't, can't activate Bobble here, someone pointed out. Uh, I would not have noticed. But I guess we're hoping Eddie doesn't find a source to plow shares. Yeah, I probably I probably would have let him draw. Uh, uh, kind of a for me. Double paying and grow the orc army, bigger than all of Eddie's blockers. I've never yeah. had to see that. Uh, card. Uh, you know this is like the only thing that would have saved me. <laughs> all right, a bolt ends the game. GGS. GGS.